Okay, guys. Good morning. Um, I'm just going to stop it real quick while I'm getting ready. So, I was going to make this yesterday, but I didn't. And also, that's fine because I did other things. But, um, yesterday I was thinking, well, not just yesterday, but in general, um, about how basically I know that I've been, like, meant to be single for a while because, <laughs> um, so, like when I was 15, I got, in a, I got in a relationship. I was in that relationship for three years, got out of it, and immediately got into another one that I was in for four years. So, by the time I turned 23, I was out of that. But I had been in, like, relationships for seven years. And even, like, in between things, I was dating. So, I was never single for, like, my early adulthood, super early adulthood, late teenhood, whatever. So, when I um, stopped dating my last boyfriend, um, I kind of hooked up with a couple other people immediately, like, you know, right afterwards. Um, it was funny because one guy, like, my friends, I don't know, we called him the tow truck guy because his car kept getting towed from my house, which was a sign for him not to fuck with me. But um, we ended up going to see each other. It was beautiful. But, um, so for the last... Over three years, I've been like completely, completely single in every, you know, way. You need to celebrate and all that. And it's funny because um, there were like a couple times where like I'd be talking to someone and as soon as I realized, I'm like, oh, I really look like I could see myself really liking them. They would just like disappear, like would ghost me. And it's not something that I would trip about because like, I don't understand people who get upset when like a stranger ghosts them. Like y'all don't know each other. Does it really that? deep like you should be thankful that they didn't waste your time oh my god what the hell oh, apparently i was bleeding i did not know um so yeah and i was just thinking about it again because like i've been thinking about dating or whatever and same thing happened you know as soon as i see like i'm talking to one person i'm like oh i can see myself really liking this person i'm getting ahead of myself um they just disappear i'm like okay you know I see what I see it I see what's going on because it's so funny because literally anytime that happens I get like the thought like that about somebody they're gone like there's this one guy who works next door and I kind of mess with him like he would look in the store when he walks by so I look at him like give him dirty looks back because I think it's kind of funny um and at one point I was like you know what I could I could fuck him right and I went on vacation and I came back and I haven't seen him since like the moment I think about like, oh yeah, no, I can, maybe I could date him or whatever. He's gone. He's fucking gone. Um, and it's always happened like that. Like with so, so many different times. Uh, it's like the universe is like being like, nope, no, no, no. And at this point, um, at like this three year mark here or plus, I'm finally like, you know what? I think I'm genuinely like actually ready to like go get back out there. Like, I have done all I could, I guess, healing-wise when it comes to relationships without being in a relationship. So, I'm like, I know I'm ready. I feel I'm ready. You know, as ready as I can be. And I'll probably come to find out that I wasn't as ready as I thought, but that's half the fun, right? But that's the thing. It's like, I know it's not that, like, I'm not ready. It's making me think that the universe is, like... Um, actually, there's somebody super specific. You're just gonna have to hold on and wait for them, which is so annoying and unfair that I have to suffer. <laughs> I'm not really, though. Like, I'm... I do... And I really like being by myself a lot. I really enjoy it. I just want to have, like, a good time, you know? But I don't, like... I'm at this point where, like, I don't... I mean, people need people, but, like, I don't need anybody else... To like validate certain things and not to say that like you know people don't deserve to have people validate things about them but like i'm pretty fucking cool by myself like i feel like i have been but especially lately like i'm really i'm really at a good place so yeah i'm thinking about like getting back out there and the universe is like mm, no like we see that you're ready and all that you're real cute but it's not happening so anyways i guess what i'm trying to say is if things like that are happening to you where you cannot fucking somehow for some reason 
people just keep ghosting, they just keep disappearing, or you meet somebody, if something happens, you take it as a fucking sign. Or like you keep meeting people and it's not working out. Take it as a sign that um you're supposed to be single and it's okay. It's okay. Maybe it's for different reasons. Maybe you actually aren't ready to be in a relationship and you need to come to terms with that and like have some personal growth first. Maybe it is somebody specific. Maybe there's something you need to do first. Like I think that maybe also that there are a couple projects that I need to get off the ground before probably I could really get like really be ready. So there are so many factors at play and you just have to like trust the universe, especially when it comes to like love. Um, so yeah, cause I, you know, there are people who are like, I don't know why I can't get with anybody. I'm like, cause you're not, it's not time. You got work to do. They got work to do. We got work to do. And it's awesome to be in love, but sometimes other things have to come first. Or just before, you know? So, that's all I have to say today. Um, I'm, I think I'm running late. Oh my god. Alright, well. Alright, later guys. I'm sweating in here. It's gonna be a hot day again. But I hope you have a good day. I might post another thing later, but bye.